What's happening YouTube? It's your boy Tech Tricks back with another video and today I'm going to talk about your safety specifically for bikes. Here we go. First things first, make sure to hit that subscribe button below. Hit that notification bell so you can be notified of the next videos to come with tips and tricks on your iPhone and your Android. Check out my merch below at 1130.ca and here we go. And today we're looking at bicycle statistics and how can we prevent this from happening. So for those of you who love uh, biking around, there's a lot of trails here in Edmonton and it's just amazing how we have that. But the first thing we need to figure out is your safety. So here are some uh, statistics that how many bikers uh, get injured every single year in Canada. Around 7,500 cyclists are seriously injured every year. So what time of the day do most bicycle injuries and crashes occur? I'll give you a second to guess what the answer would be. But it says here that most bicycle injuries and crashes occur during the afternoon rush hour. So the next question is what time of the day do most cyclist death occur? It says that one out of three cyclist deaths occur at night or where there's artificial lighting. Next question, where are cyclists more likely to be killed or injured? Cyclists are more likely to be killed or injured at an intersection or at a location where there are traffic signals or other traffic control signs. Next one, a percentage of cyclists killed in traffic crashes who were under the age of 16. And this is pretty crucial. What are your guesses? It says that 18% of cyclists killed in traffic crashes were under the age of 18. The next question is percentage of cyclists killed who were struck by a vehicle in the dark. This is a little bit higher now. 30% of cyclists who were killed were struck by a vehicle in the dark. Next one is percentage of cyclists who were struck by a truck. 19% this time for the heavy truck. And the next one is uh, percentage of cyclist deaths, uh, crashes from traffic crashes in the road. 64 percent so it's as you can see here it's pretty crucial stats here there's a lot of people that get injured and there's more percentage almost every year it gets higher as well as we get busier and busier in our roads so there's sort of so many ways to mitigate this you can put a reflector on your bike but the one thing that people miss look at is a mirror I think we need mirrors on our bikes so today we're going to show you how to install one yourself if you want to grab one yourself, I'll link this down in the description below. But basically, it's pretty easy to install. Just a couple of uh, one clamp and then the mirror sticks on there and one little bolt. So you just need a tool, uh, an Allen key, and you'll be able to tighten this up. And here you go. So this mirror as well is uh, it's a pretty cool device. You can uh, It's very sturdy. Uh, you can flip and uh, rotate the mirror itself, and uh, even if it gets bumped, uh, it won't it won't get uh, broken or anything like that. It's very sturdy as well as you could see there. So while you're uh, biking, uh, you can look at the mirror and you could see the people on the right side behind you, and you can install this on the left side, the right side doesn't matter. Um, it's there's so many options for this, and that's it. I hope I was able to help you on your safety when you're uh, riding the bike. If you are a biker, please uh, comment below if this is useful for you or not. I haven't personally tried it uh, hands-on because I'm not really much of a biker, but for those who are extreme bikers out there, comment below if uh, this is a very useful device or is it uh, gimmicky or anything like that. Make sure to hit that like button below if I was able to help you. Make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so you can be notified of the next videos to come. If you want to buy one of these, this is an affiliate link. I'll link this down in the description below. Thanks for watching. Have a good day. Uh, stay safe out there even during this uh, pandemic time. Stay safe on the road as well uh, during the month of July and even more. Make sure to uh, look look behind you and um, stay safe while you ride out there. Have a good day and thanks for watching. Peace.